Hey guys, Ben Maddox here for Johnson RV. Today we're going to be exploring our beautiful 2006 Winnebago Adventure 32D. This may look new, but it's not. This is what we specialize in, guys. This is our premium pre-owned superstore. For those of you who don't know what Johnson RV is about, we buy the nicest products out there. We put all the necessary money into them to make sure that they are operating like new just for you. So 2016 Winnebago Adventure 32D. This is a four slide 32 foot model, just over 32 feet. It's on your Ford chassis with Triton V10 motor. Uh, it's gonna give you great torque for being able to tow, great cargo carrying capacity. It's on the bigger chassis too, so it does have the 22 and a half inch tires, aluminum wheels, so Alcoa wheels means it's gonna ride quieter, it's gonna ride smoother. It does have your integrated side view cameras built in to your side view mirror, so giving you a nice clear picture all the way down your coach when you turn on your blinker. Power awning, that's metal wrap, that's gonna go all the way out and give you lots of patio space. You can see all of your uh, uh, slides also have slide toppers as well. Um, and you've got windows that open up away from the body, which means you can have them open, giving you some airflow, even if it's raining outside. Uh, three, uh, three electric steps are gonna come out. They have that non-slip grip on it. Uh, nice big entry door there with the lit handle. Uh, as far as your storage underneath, even though you do have to duck a little bit, it's not that far down. So you've got some nice, almost pass-through storage there. And then right next to us, we've got uh, about the same, and you got this little uh, TV that actually slides out, and you've got a, a flat screen TV that gives you some entertainment out on your patio with a TV receiver there. A little bit more storage there. 10 gallon Atwood hot water heater. Um, propane fill right here, so easy to get to if you need to pull into the gas station to fill up your propane tank. And then you've got some more storage there. So I'm definitely not lacking the storage, even though this is a shorter Class A. And this is one that you're going to be able to get into most, if not all, of your, uh, your parks that you're looking to get into. Um, nice rear roof ladder to be able to get on the roof. One piece seamless fiberglass roof. Nice fiberglass mold here to give you lots of insulation for the bedroom. Give you some natural light in the bedroom there as well. Uh, 5,000 pound uh, tow receiver. You've got the outside of your furnace right there. Um, generator exhaust right there. So here you've got uh, your rear bed slide. As you can see, we're real close to this other um, RV here, so we're gonna duck up underneath, but all of your utilities are gonna be here in the back. So you've got your generator here, which is a 5,500 watt generator. A lot of times in these smaller Class A's, they'll only do 4,000 watts. So that's gonna give you plenty of amperage to be able to power whatever you need to power. There's your fuel fill right there, which is an 80 gallon fuel tank. Uh, shore power connection in this compartment here with some storage. And then utilities here, these are nice swing away doors, so your dump station, auxiliary shower, black tank flush, uh, turn on your water pump, all of that in one simple place. And then you've got more storage here on the other side, there's that pass through compartment, and you've got a little bit more all the way down. So let's go take a look at the inside of this beautiful Winnebago Adventure. Hey guys, Ben Maddox here again. We are now inside this gorgeous 2016 Winnebago Adventure 32D. Hard to really tell that this is a pre-owned RV. Um, it's so well put together, so well finished, beautiful color scheme in here, nice neutral colors, rich wood, real wood. And that's one of the nice things about your nicer manufacturers. Um, really cool feature, even though this is a Ford and traditionally in your later models, you only saw a driver door in your Chevy workhorse chassis. You actually have a driver door, which just gives you one more way to get out if you need to. Um, like at the gas station, just be able to hop out if you need to. Got a integrated uh, multimedia system here. It's uh, all set up for uh, Sirius satellite radio, navigation, uh, backup camera, side view cameras, all built into that. Uh, very standard as far as your Ford chassis, but you do it's very well appointed as far as the, the leather, the fit and finish. This is more of an ultra leather or pleather material. These obviously swivel around to give you some more seating. Um, and then a nice little slide out tray for the passenger there. Some storage up above, padded vinyl ceilings, um, nice lighting all throughout so it's big, it's bright. You've got a four door fridge. Tell me how many 32 foot RVs have a four door fridge. There's not a lot. Lots of pantry space with slide out drawers, ball bearing, drawer glides, nice uh, hard surface, non-porous countertop like Corian, flush mount covers over the stove top, three burner stove top there, convection microwave oven, very nice whirlpool convection mm -hmm. microwave oven, so lots of storage down below, big two, double stainless steel sink with a residential faucet, storage up above here, and this is one of the highlights of the living area or dining area. So right now it's a couch, which actually this can convert into a sleeping area. 
Um, and I'm going to show you what this looks like. Ta-da! Do you believe in magic? So here it is all set up. Uh, obviously you've got a, a roll away extendable table. Gives you plenty of seating. I mean you could easily seat six people here and have a meal which is great for entertaining. Plus you've got the entertainment part here. So nice big flat screen TV that's at an angle so you're not having to crane your neck trying to find you know what you're watching. Um, TV receivers right below it with a, a sound bar and then electric fireplace which actually does put off some pretty good heat as well. Uh, so let's move back into the, the bathroom and the, and the bedroom area. Nice little place here where if you want to use it as a desk you can. So it's multi-purpose. It's a place to store your table up underneath and you've got outlets here. So you've got your USB and 110. Um, so bathroom right across the aisle here, all in one bathroom, but it is big. I mean, this gives you a lot of space. You have a nice big neo-angled shower. No problem here getting in and out. You've got a skylight to give you lots of headroom. Solid surface countertop here. Nice big vanity with some storage that goes deep in there. Storage here as well. And then this right now is actually a storage closet. However, it does, like a lot of these, have a false backing on it. So there is plumbing behind there. So if you wanted to put a stackable washer dryer, if you plan on living in this, that's a great option. Bedroom definitely not lacking for space either because you have opposing slides. Not something you're gonna see very often in these shorter class A's to be able to have four slides. Very common with your big 40 foot diesels, but not with 32 foot class A's. So you've got wardrobe space on each side, beautiful flat screen TV, TV receiver, all your uh, sliding drawers down below. Big queen size bed, residential queen size bed. Obviously the slide is already out, which is why you have so much living space back here. So you get the benefits of both worlds, lots of living space and sleeping space as well. So it's definitely one that could work for residential purposes as well as just your weekend getaways. Definitely one you guys gotta come in and check out if you're looking for a small class A with a lot of amenities. This is our 2016 Winnebago Adventure 32D. When you come in to Johnson RV, make sure you ask for Ben.